Hi there guys, it's me Shay Shay France and uh, welcome to another vlog. So, na nga guys, I'll be doing a review about this uh, new product from Betadine. It's called Betadine Feminine Wash Foam. Tama nga ba? Ayun, wash foam. When I saw this at Watson's, uh, a month ago. Na curious ako sa kanya because uh, yun nga, uh, nakikita ko siya sa ibang bansa pero sa atin wala. And uh, sabi ko, why not try it? So yun nga, I tried it for uh, since Betadine user ako. And since ito nga, bago to sa Philippine market. And uh, tinry ko siya. So it claim, bakit? Bakit ko siya tinry? Do wala pa siyang mga wala pa siyang mga commercial endorsements sa sa mga ano natin dito sa atin. But then, uh, bakit ko siya tinry? Kasi trusted ko ang Betadine ever since. So, ayan po siya. Ayaw niya mag-focus. Yan, si Betadine Feminine Wash Foam. So, this is a new product in the Philippines. Actually, available na po ito sa ibang Asian countries. And, um, ngayon lang nilabas or naging available dito sa Philippine market si Betadine Feminine Wash Foam. It says here sa packaging niya guys, basahin ko lang for you. Ang liit pa naman, malabong mata ko. So, sabi niya dito, Betadine Feminine Wash Foam daily use other control with with which hazel. So, sabi niya dito, everyday activities such as active perspiration periods and certain food can lead to undesirable feminine odor, making women conscious and uncomfortable. And then, ordinary soap and shower gels may offer some relief but are not targeted at the intimate area. Tama ba yung basa ko? Oo, but are not targeted at the fem intimate area. Better than feminine wash foam, daily use odor control with hazel is exclusively designed to help support relief from undesirable feminine odors while it support while supporting natural pH and flora. I've been using this for more than a month and uh, masasabi ko lahat ng uh, nakasulat dito at ang kiniklaim nito is totoo. Disclaimer lang guys, this product may work for me but will not work for you. So before using this, please consult your gynecologist. Uh, hindi po ako expert regarding sa mga ganitong mga product. But then, sinishare ko lang yung experiences ko or yung experience ko regarding using this product. So guys, this product talaga is really effective for me. First, uh, it's very gentle. Wala po akong na-feel na may konting irritation or itchiness while using this product. Kasi nga, ito, sinasabi ko, more than a month ko na siyang ginagamit and I'm so very happy about it. And, yung kiniklaim niya dito sa packaging niya, dito sa bottle, it says here, it's um, soap, paraben, and colorant-free. Yes. Kasi clear lang siya. Wala siyang ibang color. Next, it's uh, gynecologically tested, which is, I believe, kasi knowing betadine, hindi sila basta-basta naglalabas ng product na hindi tinetest or natest na ng mga expert. And next, it it says here, it helps maintain natural pH daw. Dun sa down under natin. That's why siguro ako, nagustuhan ko siya and uh, hiyang ako sa kanya, it's because wala nga ako na feel na irritation and dryness. Alam nyo yun, guys? Kasi merong mga iba na feminine wash na nakaka-dry talaga. Kaya hindi din sila pwedeng gamitin for daily wash. But then this one, I use it daily. Next, it contains probiotics. So, guys, ang probiotics is responsible for uh, odor control. So, ayun ang maganda sa kanya. And it says here, ayun na nga, yung sabi ko kanina, it moisturizes gently and it is hypoallergenic. So, mild siya, guys. So, ayun yung nagustuhan ko sa kanya. Plus, yung content niya, meron siyang witch hazel. Ayun niya mag-focus. Yan. May witch hazel siya. 
Gusto ko yung witch hazel kasi fan ako ng witch hazel, guys. Y yung kineclaim niya dito is uh, proven ko na rin na very effective and totoo kasi ako never ako na-irritate while using this product. And kahit pawisan ka, guys, pawisan ka, nag-jogging ka, basta pawis na pawis ka sa mga activities na ginawa mo, wala siyang amoy. Gusto ko pa dito is uh, paraben fifth. Paraben free siya. Hindi siya harsh at wala siyang masyadong chemicals. So another thing na nagustuhan ko is it's drip free siya guys. Hindi siya basta-basta tumatapon. Actually guys, fan ako ng Betadine. Uh, ever since Betadine yung ginagamit ko. Since nahiyang ako sa kanya. For daily use ko, ito siya before. And then for red days, ito yung ginagamit ko. Twice a week lang. Pag red days kasi po, pwede mo siyang i-daily. Pwede mo siyang gawin daily. Um, pag meron ka lang. Pag may period. Pag ka wala, I, this is the one that I use. Actually, konti na lang siya, guys. So, kaya ito, nagustuhan ko si Wash Foam. It's because it's drip-free. Unlike this one. Madali siyang matapon, guys. <laughs> kasi, liquid nga siya. Ayan, guys. Ayan. Ito nyo yan? Yan ba? tumatapon siya. But then, Betadine foam wash. Dahil foam siya, guys. Look at it. Hindi siya basta-basta tumatapon, guys. Ayan. Unlike the liquid one. Unlike this one. Don't get me wrong, parehong gusto ko itong product na to. Because I've been using this. Tignan nyo naman, ang laki niya, diba? I've been using this for a long time. And, of course, this one. Ito kasi nakakatuwa. It's because, ayan siya. Drip free siya, guys. Yan, diba? And, uh, napaka mild ng odor niya, guys. Yan. And kahit ganyan-ganyan mo, hindi ka mag-aaksaya ng product. Kasi nga, yan. It's just stay on my palm. Siyempre, tutulo to. <laughs> Kasi masyad, uh, may liquid pa naman siya. But what I mean is that, hindi katulad ng liquid, yung isa, yung ganito, is mabilis siyang magdi-drip. But then, ito, tignan nyo, oh. It stays on my, it stays on my palm. Kaya, gustong gusto ko siya, guys. And guys, very matipid siya. Hindi mo kailangan gawin yung ginawa ko kanina. Yung napakaraming ilalagay mo sa palm. Pinakita ko lang naman para makita nyo kanina na hindi talaga siya masyado mabilis mag-drip. So, but me, when I'm using this product, ganito lang. Isang pump lang. Yun lang guys. Sapat na. O pwede na siya. So, yun na nga guys. Again, um, Kine-claim ko na this product is uh, effective for me and it really works for me. Hiyang ko siya. But, this product may not work for you. So, before trying this one, uh, maybe you can consult your gynecologist or your doctor para at least naman iwas irritation kayo. So, that's it guys. Thank you for watching this video and uh, see you in my next vlog.